The new Oink Ink is your solution if you are tired of your tags being painted over or buffed by chemical solvents. With the new Oink Ink, you can fill your favorite open flow drip mop marker or pump valve action marker with our industrial grade, high staining ink and know that the tags you leave in your wake will not fade for one to three years or more and will be the hardest to remove hand styles on the block, bleeding through up to five layers or more of bucket paint and being the most difficult to remove using chemical solvents. The intention of the new Oink Ink is to not be able to be removed at all or leaving behind a ghost when buffed, which is to say a faint but still visible tag after chemical solvents have removed much of the base ink, leaving behind only our top secret staining chemicals after hours of frustrating elbow grease by the person trying to remove your work. PointGuardLTD.com has been in operation for over 12 years, offering the finest in graffiti art supplies anywhere on the planet at the best price. The new Oink Ink is the evolution of the original Oink Ink, which we are proud to say started the movement in hard staining, hard to buff inks. The new Oink Ink continues that hard earned history using the same hard staining chemicals as the original Oink Ink, now with a superior opaque black, outdoor use approved industrial grade base ink, making it head and shoulders superior to the original Oink Ink and unquestionably significantly superior to any other supposedly staining inks on the market. Due to our previous spray paint manufacturing factory shutting down and a desire to not make an inferior product, we hope you can forgive us as we continue to tour new spray paint factories and sample new lines before we restart production of the new fresh paint within the next 12 to 18 months. For now, we're so excited to bring you the new Oink Ink and we're so excited to hear your feedback via email to me, James, at oinkartltd at gmail.com or by sending me a text message anytime at 732-646-5278. It is our belief that within the repertoire of every great graffiti writer, there should be a great hand style, a great throw up, and last but not least, solid piecing skills. Each and every one of our customers and supporters is absolutely great. And we're so excited with the new Oink Ink to help bring beautifully dripping hand styles back to the forefront of our community. And we appreciate you leading the charge. You are what keeps graffiti and the graffiti movement alive. Thank you for your support of me, my family, our team, and of OinkArtLTD.com. We recognize that without you, we would not exist. And we're so proud to serve you for the last 12 years and for decades to come. Thank you for all you do. Keep crushing and we'll see you in the streets. Thank you all so much for being with us today. Now we're gonna show you a little bit of how we make the new Oink Ink. Um, as you can see directly below us, we've got our industrial grade base ink that we had specially made just for the new Oink Ink. We've got our industrial grade chemicals that we use. They're not necessarily made for making ink, but they're ones we use. As we mentioned in the original Alchemy video, there's five different chemicals we use that no one else uses. Three of them, no one in production has ever used before to our knowledge. And so yeah, we're real stoked to get to show you some of that. We're gonna show you how we fill a bottle. We're gonna show you how we fill a marker. And we appreciate you joining us. So my friend Marquise is here with me today. Come on, Marquise. Um, Marquise and his brother Walter are really the people helping to run the business on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, I do a lot of the work, but without Walter and Marquise, I wouldn't be here, as well as um, a friend of mine from Chicago and a number of other people who are really pivotal in oinking continuing every day. So as you can see, directly here behind us, we have our barrel that we keep most of the mixed ink in. Um, that smell is so good. Anyone who's used the original oink ink knows about that. And so uh, it's kind of hard to see because it's so pitch black. But inside that barrel, we have our already mixed ink. And the way that we get to that stage of the ink already being mixed, once you have gloves on, is by taking some of the base ink that we have here and we mix it up a little bit first to make sure that it's ready for use. Pull up and pop the top on it. And as you can see, that's brand new with a fresh plastic seal on it. And as you can see, that barrel is super duper full. So the first thing that we do is we remove our larger barrel and yeah, uh, my friend Big E who's filming, he's taking a little sniff there. You can definitely smell it when you pop that fresh bottle. So we pour a little bit of the base ink into our larger barrel 
just to make space to get in the chemicals. Then we take 50 grams of each of the staining chemicals that we use and uh, add that to the base ink. And as you can see, all three of these are significantly different. The other two chemicals that we use are already pre-mixed into our uh, base ink. And these other ones that we add are ones that only we use, no one else in the industry uses. So all of these chemicals that we use, you're not going to be able to purchase on your own. You're going to have to have a chemical license to purchase. And we do all the grunt work that's also pretty dangerous of making the ink for you. Oink Art Black Ink, 100% made by us, full of all kinds of toxic chemicals. You will not be able to find this anyplace else. And so, give that a little bit more shake. And what's interesting, Marquise can tell you more about this, but you can literally feel the barrel heating up as those chemicals react with each other. That's not something you're going to get with your mom's homemade staining ink. So we pull that back up. The chemical reaction inside has already occurred now. And then we pour that into the master barrel of ink. At oinkartlte.com, we also offer the original Oink Ink Drip Mop. That's what we're going to be filling and using today, but you can use any drip mop marker. You can use any pump action valve marker. You'll be good to go with the new Oink Ink. You take our nib, shove it down in there, make sure it's nice and secure. Flips upside down, no problem. And we're good to go. Now let's go use it. You want to kind of... Get a few squeezes in, make sure it's flowing the way you want it to. As you can see, nice and solid opaque black, nice drips coming from it. I do like squeezing them off as I go, so I have a little bit more drips than other people might have, but it looks fantastic. And even though it's been raining outside, we're gonna give that 15 minutes to dry, and then we'll come back and film painting over it. So we don't have any bucket paint with us today, but we do have white spray paint. So we're gonna show you now how the new oink ink bleeds straight through when you paint over it. As you can see with our first heavy coat of white spray paint, it's like it wasn't even there. The blue, black, and purple staining inks, along with that hard opaque black base ink, come straight through. As you can see when you look down here at the tags of my daughter's names, Sydney and Eden, you can see that hard black opaque staining ink there. And when you look up here at my name and also my son's name, which has now been painted over by white spray paint, you can see that blue tint as it's the base ink and the three staining chemicals that only we know of and use bleeding through super hard with the ink on the top. We're gonna to give it five minutes. We'll come back and put two or three more coats of white paint and we'll continue to show you how it bleeds through multiple layers of paint, no problem. Now we're gonna apply a second layer of white spray paint here. And as you can see, even when that second layer is being applied, it's coming straight through it. As you can see with multiple layers of paint, the new Oink Ink with our hard staining chemicals comes straight through. So you can count on the new Oink Ink to help you be the most permanent player in your city. A third layer just for fun. Three layers of paint like it never even happened. 